Ollie sleeping? I I'll tell you how to wake him up. You still like this. Good morning, Ollie. Wherever you are, that's where I wanna be. All it took was a laugh and that soft sunset. Big blue eyes looked up inside. This is home. Just running around, you never look so cute. Hugging your tie, cutting all I could take in. I am home. Home's forever young with me. Good morning. Someone's raiding the toy box this morning. I don't know what he does, but he loves climbing in the toy box and stepping on all the toys. I think maybe he's getting like a foot massage with the with the toys. He just like steps on them and it massages his feet maybe. I don't know. Ooh, Jesse's hat. Look at that. Oh. <laughs> I always find him hanging out in the toy box though. So funny. Can you say good morning, Finn? Can you say good morning? Not yet? Maybe tomorrow? Good morning guys! It has been such an awesome, productive morning. Um, I got up and I made breakfast, I cleaned the kitchen, and I got ready all before 11. <laughs> Which might seem a little funny, but the kids get a little bit crazy in the morning. So yeah, I'm gonna film a fun little video, and I'm just finished doing my hair, which I have not curled my hair in a while. I've been doing it straight because it just seemed easier, but I'm excited to have it a little bit curled today. And I am sitting on this, basically a shower bench <laughs> right now because the chair that I did have in here broke. I had like a really big, like comfy, like really smushy chair. Finn was just really sick one night. Brian sat on it and it literally just like broke. And the chair was just clearly like, just kept, I think we like have bent it a couple times. So one of the legs just kind of like gave out finally. So it was really scary because Brian was holding Finn and like basically fell and had to like protect Finn from falling. So and basically I do not have a chair. I just have one of these, which works, but I would like to get a new one, so. Anyways, off to a very productive day. And today we are going to be saying goodbye to this beautifully colored on wall. wall. Um, the painter is finally coming today, which I gotta say, I'm kind of sad. It looks really cool, I think, but I don't know. I'm also ready for, <laughs> for it to be back to normal. But it would be fun to have a wall, like even if it was like in the playroom that was just kind of colored on with paint, but then I don't want them to color on it all the time. So I don't want them to think they can color on walls. So I don't know, but I just think it's kind of fun to walk in and see like some colorful art that Ollie did. Come on. Peyton, what's going on? <laughs> Is Ollie sleeping? Yeah. I I'll tell you how to wake him up. He's still like this. Good morning, Ollie. He's being a baby. I guess you shouldn't do that to a baby. Hey, Ollie. He's being a good newborn baby. You see your video? Yeah? This is so funny. You and Kay. You are so cute. <laughs> Yes, Ollie and Pei filmed a video together on Missy's channel. I'll have it linked down below. They answered some questions and it was so cute because they're like best friends. I loved it. Peyton, you know who you look like today? What? Minnie Mouse. Because she has her red polka dot dress just like that. Yeah. Okay, she's gone. <laughs> are you a kitty now? You are such a good actor. Ollie is a very good actor. You might see him on the Disney Channel. All right, it's time for that Band-Aid to come off, and Tal is going to help Mr. Finnegan take his Band-Aid off. Quickly, oh, oh, oh! See, she's a pro at it. Isn't that cool? <laughs> he got worried there for a little bit. I think that is one reason why Ollie does not do Band-Aids when he gets shots. He actually requested no Band-Aid. One time we did leave it on a little bit too long, and then it hurt coming off, and they're just not fun coming off. All right, it is actually Finn's nap time. I feel like I've been saying this for so long, but we are officially going to start weaning. He doesn't nurse very often. It is very few times, but when he does, it is like he demands it, and I'm kind of just reaching that point where it's not fun anymore. <laughs> Like, I love it, but I, it's like a love-hate relationship right now. And I've never really had that before. So I've been reading up some different ways to wean. Basically a toddler, because he's basically a toddler now. He doesn't really reason yet, because he's still a baby. <laughs> I'm just trying to give him other things that he enjoys. So he knows, like, he's like, okay, I need my blankie. What's that one? 
You want that blinky? Get your blinky. Can I help? There you go. Blinky, your milk. Don't let it come out. Don't let it come out. So what I'm doing is I'm trying to give him a sort of milky drink before bed, before he goes down when he normally would want to nurse, um, and making it kind of super special. He only gets it during the times that he would normally want to nurse. And this drink that I made him is basically a warmed up whole milk with a little bit of organic maple syrup. I'd like to use honey, but I actually didn't have any in there. And then a little bit of sea salt. I don't know why, <laughs> why the sea salt, but he seems to be liking it. It's probably just like a little bit of a sweeter milk, which he doesn't get unless he nurses. I'm hoping that works. I know that he doesn't just drink her nurse for the milk he also wants to comfort so I'm hoping that he'll be willing to just do that instead of nurse it's a very long process I've been doing this for so long now and I will say that Ollie was a lot easier to wean than this one he's addicted huh you're addicted to the boob he's like get in your chair mom let's do this yeah that did not go well he was not happy with the milk drink as soon as we sat down he was like uh-uh mom you know what I want so I had to just lay him in his crib with his drink he will normally only cry for like 10, 15 seconds and then fall to sleep or go to bed. But it is so sad, I hate him. Aw, oh, look at him. He's trying to fall asleep now. The time has come. We're covering it up. <laughs> Ollie was not too excited about it. He was like, what are you doing, Mom? That is my masterpiece. Um, so we set up a little area for them to do some coloring and painting out here. Sure. All right guys, so super change of plans today. I just got done doing a bunch of stuff and Ollie walked up to me and he was like, Mama, my ear hurts, I need medicine. I have an ear infection. And I was like, what? I thought, I thought at first he was just like playing, but then I was like, show me which ear. And he was like, this one, ouch, owie. So, I was so first of all, I'm so proud of him for actually telling me that his ear hurts, but now he's asleep and I'm running into the doctors. I feel like this is my second home these days. I've been here like, Constantly. Hopefully, if he does have an air infection, we caught it. It might be the same one that he had before and it just it's resurfacing. Alright, so they just took his temperature. He's actually still, he slept through the temperature and it said that he does have a low 100 degree fever. So I, I'm thinking he really does have an ear infection. I'm just so proud of him for telling me. I'm not being scared to go to the doctors because he was like, I just don't want a shot. And I said, I promise you won't get a shot. He said, I think I need medicine, mama. That's so cute. He's like, I'm gonna sleep through this. All right, Ollie, what's the verdict? <laughs> so we went to the doctor and what did they say? Do you have an ear infection or no? No shots and no band-aids. No shots and no band-aids, but do you have an ear infection? Yes. Yes, he actually has an ear infection. He has a double ear infection now. And the ear that he said hurts is less infected than the other one. The other one's more infected than this one. So yeah, I'm really bummed, but we got his medicine. We got it taken care of just in the nick of time. I literally ran in there at 4.30. They more, close at five. I need more medicine my ear hurts. Yeah, his, he's like, wait, that's it? I said, yeah, I promise, no shots. He goes, but my ear still hurts. I was like, yes, you do have to take medicine. But we're a big boy, so you don't, you're not scared, right? Yeah, he's not scared. All right, the boy is home. How did it go, Ollie, at the doctor's? Good. What'd they say? It's uh, no shots and no band-aids. No shots or band-aids, okay. But what did they say about your ears? The end hurts hurt and now the two ears hurt. Both yes. of them hurt? Yeah. So what do you have, though? I have my red medicine and my white medicine. You have re red medicine and white medicine, yes. <laughs> That's true, huh? <laughs> Ollie, both ears are infected. You have a double ear infection. Yeah. And you just took your medicine like a pro, didn't you? Yeah. You did it like such a good boy. Medicine. Oh, no, I got your medicine right here. <laughs> Finn. Finn just wants to give you a hug because he, he knows that you're not feeling well. He wasn't feeling good the other day, too, so. It's yeah, on me. Finn's just a lover. He just wants to love on a lady. What do we have here? That is so stinking cool. He's gonna love that. Yeah. <laughs> Will you go give this to your brother? He's had a tough day. We'll give that to Ollie. <laughs> Thank you, Finn. Isn't that cool, Ollie? Yeah. Here's some more darts. So what kind of dinosaur is this? It's a Triceratops. And that's a Power Ranger? Yeah. That's so cool. Here, you want to play? Yeah. 
Yeah, you can go play. Look at the blanket. He's so dramatic sometimes, I feel he's like. like it. He's a lot like his dad. Yeah, man flu. <laughs> he's already, Ollie already has man flu, ladies and gentlemen. Fire! Ollie oh. picked out something. Woo! Yeah, remember we picked out something for Finn? You want to show Finn? Yeah. Finn's like, I'm gonna go Finn's like, I got something? I got something? What I can't. Oh. <laughs> Come here, Ollie, let's go get it. I got a Lego block for you, Finn. Did you see what he got you? We had so much fun with Legos, and Finn wants to play too, huh? I would just like to add that these are not Legos. <laughs> they are Mega Blocks, but it is a good starting point. I can get it. Oh, it. don't try that at home, ladies and gentlemen. Ooh, this is gonna be fun for us. We all used to have these, and we actually played with them a ton. Yeah. What do you think of that? Yeah, we don't have them anymore, but that's why we got some for Finn. Do you want to see what they do? Look. <laughs> <laughs> Did you see that? That was so cute, his reaction. <laughs> <laughs> do you want to build them high? Whoa. Okay, see that back. I see that. <laughs> I'm telling you, Lego's like in our blood. I know. <laughs> Look how big it is now. Whoa! <laughs> you wanna do it higher, ready? Whoa! That's pretty deep, <laughs> huh? <laughs> That's awesome. Good find, babe. He loves that. Can you karate chop it, Ollie? Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> it's okay. Okay, I'm recording. What do you want to say? It's we say white, white men in it, but I like the women in Oh, yeah? Mom tried to give you white medicine and you only like the red kind? Yeah, so Ollie had to take his antibiotic, which is white, and he apparently didn't want it, so Mama instead gave you the red kind? Yeah? Or it turned red, magically. I don't know. <laughs> we do what we can to make our kids take medicine, okay? So now, Missy, are you, oh, are you cleaning or organizing? I'm just organizing the Legos. I got the little Lego bins. We got Lego bins. And I got little Lego things that little kids should have played with in the Lego heads. Oh. And the Lego Duplo in the basement. Oh. doing some organizing, I think. Anyway, Ollie, you want to end the vlog today? Yeah. Okay. Thanks for watching. Thumbs up, subscribe. We'll see you manana, right? See you later. Okay, bye. Boop. <laughs>